Hi everyone, and uh, it's great to uh, be back making another uh, traditional white shaving video again. Um, this is Sean speaking to you. It's been a little while since I've uh, done uh, such a uh, recording. However, I am back, and uh, I am pleased to uh, feature uh, the newest uh, shaving cream from uh, Taylor of Old Bond Street, which is this. The Royal Forest Shaving Cream. And... Uh, Yes, I can't wait to uh, give this a try. So uh, let's not waste any more time and uh, let's go ahead and uh, lather up. How's everybody today? the face so I'll prop I'm going to apply a pre-shave uh, lotion here uh, pro rasso this can't go wrong always it helps me uh, give the uh, perfect shave I'll just apply this to my face yeah I heard um, this particular scent from uh, Tale of Old Bond Street it doesn't uh, really smell all that foresty. It smells more, more like uh, pineapple than anything, but uh, we shall see. So I hope everybody's doing well, having great shaves and um, being su successful out of life. Okay, here we are. Rinse that off. Now, try this out. I've got my uh, good old Vi Long uh, horsehair brush to uh, help me out here. There, I think that should be good enough. Let's go ahead. Use the eraser that I'll use today, the uh, Parker 91. I've loaded a fresh uh, feather blade in here, so uh, I expect a, a very close uh, shave. Okay. And I've got my uh, good old uh, shaving mug right here. It's really a coughing mug, but can't go wrong without it. Works just the same. Mmm, really nice scent. I think the reviews were right. It does smell rather um, fruity. Yeah. Just have to get this uh, lather right. Now, I don't want this to be too thick, yet um, I don't want it to be too thin either, which is kind of why you have to learn the craft of uh, mixing this kind of shaving cream. It's more like an art uh, compared to uh, what you would use with the irregular kind of shaving foams from Gillette or Schick, whoever. Excellent lather. 
and I'll just go ahead and start applying this to my face. Okay, there we are. Got the lather ready. Let's give this cream a try. Start with the first pass with the grain. Yeah, it's what I expect from uh, your typical uh, shaving cream from Taylor Bold Bond Street. Very uh, easy to lather, uh, very slick. Yeah, I think the reviews were right. Um, I read that um, the notes are pineapple, bergamot, apple, amber, patchouli. Yeah, I can uh, really uh, pick out the pineapple in the scent. Even Maybe even a little bit of the apple too. But yeah, in general, all uh, Taylor of Old Bond Street uh, creams are decent. I always feel like royalty uh, whenever I uh, shave like this. And I think it was appropriate for um, Tobbs to give uh, this cream kind of a, such a name. Well, not so much the forest, because I don't think this smells uh, really foresty, but uh, ro the royalty aspect of it, yes, for sure. This makes me feel like royalty. And uh, I bet a lot of you guys uh, feel like royalty too whenever you shave like this.
There we go. Yeah. Yep, yeah, this cream smell smells decent. It's not a, over, too overpowering. Ah, oh, there we go. Already feels nice and smooth, but um, I will have her, have her do um, three passes. Maybe even a touch-up uh, pass at the end. Yeah, so far, I'm, I'd say I'm impressed with this uh, particular shaving cream. Gives a top-notch top performance, and uh, it smells great, too. Okay, I'll go with the, my second pass, cross grain. There we go. Yeah, just a tip from the uh, experts that I learned. Whenever you're, whenever I'm uh, applying um, cream or soap to my face to lather up, I just I always go in a circular motion. Then uh, afterwards, I paint sideways and then upwards to get the uh, maximum. Uh, The maximum levels of uh, comfort and uh, just to make sure that uh, it's applied so evenly across my face. Yeah, so from what I understand, this um, particular scent is uh, Taylor Vold Bond Street's take on uh, the Creed Aventus uh, cologne for men. Oh. 
from what I read, it's uh, pretty expensive. Yeah, I think it's like under $500 per bottle. That's US. I'm in Canada. I think that'd be more like $600 Canadian. when you factor in the exchange rate. But. but I think um, a scent, well, the aftershave a cream that I'll use uh, afterwards, after I'm done shaving, will be good enough for me. No need for me to spend hundreds of, of hundreds of dollars that uh, for something I'll only use rarely. <laughs> oh, I'm such a mess. <laughs> All right, there we go. Second pass done. Just get, I'll just rinse off and uh, go on to the third. again.
Okay, here we are. So now I'm gonna go shave against the grain. My third pass. Yeah, um, as much as I'm enjoying this uh, particular cream, I think uh, it doesn't quite uh, beat my uh, favorite. I don't think this is my absolute, this has become my uh, absolute favorite scent from Taylor of Old Bond Street. I think uh, that spot uh, still belongs to uh, German Street. You know that that is a wonderful uh, scent. German Street from Taylor of Old Bond Street. Wow. It's kind of funny how uh, they would give they would assign the name Royal Forest to this uh, particular cream. It doesn't smell uh, like evergreen trees or cedar wood at all. Because you can... Uh, uh, Excuse me, you can really uh, pick out the uh, sense of uh, pineapple and apple out of this a lot. Yeah, there's uh, another YouTuber who I uh, watch occasionally, Kevy Shaves. Yes, uh, he's got some pretty good uh, material. He's, he always comes up with a video every single week uh, featuring new products. Yeah, creams, aftershaves, razors that are quite rare. Yeah, I recommend checking him out. Yeah, yeah, and this feather blade it's certainly helping my, make my face feel real smooth.
There we go. Well, I'm going to do a, a quick cleanup pass. I'll apply the uh, buffing technique. Squeeze all this out. Hmm. So, my verdict on this cream, if you want to uh, buy this, I recommend you do so. Go for it. It's a great scent. You know, I'll just have to remember to do this uh, very gently, especially with a feather blade in this razor. Yeah, I think I'll leave it at that. Peace. Face looks and feels good enough. Okay, I'll just uh, go ahead and rinse off.
and uh, apply the aftershave. Oh, there we go. Just pat down my face here. Okay, yeah, that's incredibly smooth. This uh, cream certainly did perform well. Yes, did meet my uh, expectations. Thank you, Tale of Old Bond Street. Now, I apply this, the Royal Forest Aftershave Cream. <laughs> All right, so there you have it. 